Tonight, military officials assessing intelligence gathered from the raid in Yemen while investigating what went wrong, why civilians, including children, were killed. Military officials saying Navy SEALs approaching their objective by foot met with heavy gunfire. They returned fire and soon a furious firefight was underway. Women unexpectedly took up arms, shooting from rooftops. The SEAL team, surrounded on all sides, continued the mission to gather intelligence picking up computers and cell phones. Cobra attack helicopters circling nearby were called in for close air support, leveling enemy positions and leading potentially to civilian deaths. As the battle escalated, a nearby Osprey made a hard landing, injuring some crew on board. Disabled, the out-of-action aircraft was destroyed by a precision bomb from a jet, keeping it from falling into enemy hands. The White House today insisting the raid was a success. This was a very, very well thought out and executed uh, effort. It is a successful operation by, by all standards. Spicer arguing that it was President Obama's team that signed off on the operation. A former Obama administration official disputed that, saying planning was underway prior to the inauguration. Another tweeting, the specific operation in question was never presented to or considered by the Obama administration for approval. President Trump making his decision after a dinner last Wednesday. When the president is approving this kind of operation, you want to make sure that he is considering the full range of, uh, of voices beyond what the Department of Defense can offer, and that includes the intelligence community and the State Department. Tonight, officials are calling the intelligence substantial, using the word actionable, a strong hint that more aggressive operations could be on the way. Hans Nichols, NBC News, the Pentagon. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.